Hey guys, in this video we're going to learn how to factor out a greatest common factor from an expression. And in this example we have a negative 4x minus 7y. So when you're looking for the greatest common factor in an expression, you're looking for the number or a product of numbers or variables that you can divide out each term by evenly. So we're going to use this chart on the right and write both of our terms into this little half rectangular box. So we have negative 4x and negative 4y. So quickly, if you look at both terms, they both have a negative in it, and you can't divide 4 or 7 by a common factor other than 1. So our greatest common factor between negative 4x and negative 7y is going to be a negative 1. Now, one little trick is that you want to look at the leading term, and if it's negative, you always want to factor out the negative 1. So even if the second term isn't negative, if the leading one is negative, then that would be part of your greatest common factor. So when I factor out that negative 1 from both terms, I'm left with a positive 4x and a positive 7y. So the greatest common factor between these two terms is just 1. So to find my GCF, since there's nothing else, I'll multiply negative 1 and 1, and my GCF would be just negative 1. So what that looks like is when I divide it out from this binomial, negative 4x minus 7, you're dividing a negative 1 from both terms. So on the outsides are negative 1, so when we divide negative 4x by negative 1, in parentheses, we're left with a 4x, and then negative 7y divided by negative 1 would be plus 7y. And this expression is completely factored.